Hi girls! Happy Sunday! I uh, kind of see what time is it. It is almost two o'clock in the afternoon here in Northwest Oregon and since we're about three hours I think behind everybody else you guys should be getting close to dinner time. <laughs> so, but I don't know when you're gonna be watching this. So anyway I hope you had a great day. Hope you had a wonderful day at church. Uh, if you didn't go to church hope you had a wonderful day resting and hopefully you got to rest. Okay. This is going to be a, a little teeny tiny plan with me. Whoa, I got you in here close so you can kind of see what I'm doing here. If you watch my videos, you will know the other day for fall, I went from my pink Kiki, Kiki K personal size planner to this one, uh, which is an Agenda 52. And I like it. It's very, very pretty. But I just can't get overly excited about it. I love the inside. I love that gray polka dot. Um, but I cannot get with these silver rings. I have an, a couple of large Agenda 52s. Um, and one of them has silver rings. One of them has pretty gold rings. And I'm like, why don't they put gold rings in all of them? I actually did a giveaway one time with a small one that had gold rings. And... Anyway, I'm just, I know you can change them out. I'm just not proficient at how to do that. So I'm going to be, number one, training these out for this Kiki K. This isn't by any means my favorite. I have a, uh, for the personal size, I have a pretty pink, very ballerina pink one. And then I have this uh, one that's light blue, almost periwinkle that I absolutely love. But I thought for at least through Christmas, that the shiny gold might be fun. Here, let me get you guys a little bit more in frame here. Huh, let's see. Let's make it go up. There we go. Sorry, technical dif difficulties there hoping that works okay so anyway so I'm going to switch into this one because like I said I thought this would be pretty through Christmas January I'll probably go back to one of the other two because I they are my favorites so I'm going to take everything this is the same old process I did the other day so much fun so I'm going to take everything out of the agenda 52 and ladies, that's not to say I don't like Agenda 52. I really do. Of all of the store brands, um, you know, Agenda 52 is my favorite. Webster's Pages, I love. I don't know if that is a Joann's um, personal thing or not. I really don't know, but I know you get, they have their own website, so I don't think it's just Joann's for sure. But anyway, uh, that is a beautiful one. Webster's Pages. I have one of theirs. It's a, a A5, and I use that for my planning on um, for my social media. And it is it's a nice planner. And the Agenda 52s, they're not that nice. They're not as nice as the Webster Pages or Carpe Diem. But as far as the store brand, and Agenda 52 is Hobby Lobby's name brand, they're much better than Michael's. Uh, they have Michaels has a recollection collection <laughs> that was like hey there I'm rhyming um, and uh, I've, I've I've actually got one that I'm giving away when I hit a thousand a big a5 that is beautiful but I just don't like the texture of it so and you know I've got a million carpe diems and then I've got several Kiki K's so I just kind of stick with those when it comes to my a5 but anyway, somebody's going to get one when I hit a thousand. And I think what I'm going to do today is the, um, in case you're watching later, today is October the 6th. And I've been trying to get to 800 subscribers and so I can give away a happy planner that I purchased for that specific reason. And it's dated, so we're already in. It's an academic planner, so it only goes to like July of next year, and we are already in October. So what I'm going to do, it doesn't look like I'm going to hit 
800. I might hit it this month, but I don't want to wait any longer. I am going to go ahead and do the drawing tomorrow for everyone that's entered that. And go ahead and give it away because I want whoever gets it to be able to enjoy as much of it as possible. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to make sure you get it. So be watching tomorrow, the 7th. And we will give away a happy planner. Yes, we will. Putting these back in. Okay. Almost done. Whoopsies. I'm making you shake again. You know what I would like? I would like a camera that I could suspend from my ceiling. <laughs> or, or, or uh, and I've been thinking about this. I think I can do this. Get one of the, uh, well, I think they call them Gorilla. Um, oh my gosh. It's, you know, you can attach it to your, to your stand and a tripod and it's a Gorilla and it bends. So I could actually attach it to this tripod and then bend it over so that you get a nice, good top side view. I think I'm gonna do that. That's a genius idea that I just came up with. <laughs> and trust me, I'm sure it's not the first person <laughs> to come up with it. Put my little gold chew in my little gold Kiki K. All right, so let's do a plan with me real quick. I'm gonna plan out um, this week's planned out, so I'm gonna go ahead and plan out next week. So just gotta flip over here to October. So see, I'm planned out through the 12th, which is next Saturday. And so I'm going to be planning out this day. So let's pop them out. I should have just left them out. But I didn't, so that requires a lot of brain power that I don't have. I had a coffee today, guys. I have been, you know, kind of fasting coffee because I'm trying to cut down on my sugar. But I was literally, and this is no reflection on my pastor whatsoever, but I was falling asleep all day long at church. And I'm like, oh gosh, I gotta, I gotta have something to wake up. All right, my cats just noticed the Christmas tree. Get down, get down. Nah, nah, okay. And no, I haven't put up my Christmas tree yet. What I've done is I uh, bought a pretty four foot one from Hobby Lobby a couple weeks ago. And I put it up because I just wanted to see what it looked like. I'm going to decorate it here in my um, craft room so I can have a Christmas tree for Christmas season. And so I put it up and now, and there's my cat. She's saying hello. She was giving you guys a purry hug. But um, yeah, that's what she's kind of curious about right now. And I'm like, uh-uh, girl. No, no, no. Okay, go, go, go. Her name is Miss Arabella. For those of you who watch me, you have seen her before. Yes, you have. Okay, so what I'm going to try and do is I'm going to try to use the washi tape out of this that I got from um, it's the Happy Planner. It was on clearance. And, you know, keeping with the fall and kind of a little Halloween theme. They've got some pretty colors in here I can use. So I'm going to do that. And then I'll have to see what I want to do with stickers. Because the smaller ones, I don't, I used to just plan the heck out of them, cover every inch of them. But you know, that leaves you no room to actually write what you need to do. So, I'm not going to do that this time. I'm going to try and control myself. So, I like this. It's black and purple. And it's always a good color to go with for, for Halloween. Um, 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 um. Oh, goodness, my puppies are over there trying to get comfortable on their little pillow bed. Okay, I think I'm going to do this one first. The one thing I've noticed about this particular book by Happy Planner, the stickers are extremely thin. They're actually, well, it's a washi tape sticker book, so I guess that's why. <laughs> I was going to say, it's kind of like washi tape. Well, duh. <laughs> All right, so this one I'm going to put right up here. I'm going to just wrap it around instead of trying to cut it off, and I'll continue that theme next week. And then what's next? What do we want to see? we got polka dots, too. 
and polka dots is a really good one for Halloween. I didn't buy any really any seasonal, you know, washi tape or anything this year. These right here, you know, things like to say best week ever and all that stuff. Well, how do you know? I'm not going to go in after the week's over and put it in there. I guess it's good for memory keeping, but for planning, not so much. You don't know if it's going to be the best week ever. <laughs> oh, that's cute. I should have used that together. See, guys? I'll keep that out for next week, though. I'm going to tear it out just to remind myself. Put it in there for next week. Okay, this is cute. If I can figure out where to put it. Okay. Do, do, do. Oh, and that that's really cute. Hmm. I'll have to cut that in half to fit. Well, no. Not necessarily. Hmm. <laughs> Well, first of all, I want to put this little header right up underneath the weak part. My depth perception is terrible, so sometimes I end up getting my washi tape so crooked. It makes me so mad because I'm like, it was perfect when I first put it in there. Uh, we'll put this right in the middle. I've got to get me a pair of those little tweezers for the small little decorations. See? See how much trouble I'm having? This is why I bump things with my car. <laughs> oh, goodness. Okay, here we go. Now we're getting to some cute stuff. I have also noticed with these sticker books that sometimes the paper stays stuck to the um, the sticker and it becomes completely of no use. And that's just not cool. They need to fix that. I actually had one of my um, Happy Planner sticker books that one page, it's just one page, thank goodness, but one page was completely miscut. So none of the, none, none of the stickers would come off. All right. So it's just, uh, so what I did is I just, see, crooked. I went ahead and I tore them out and then I just, I cut them to make them side decorations. That worked, but if I, you know, still. That was kind of weird for some of ever got one like that. So I won't complain too much since it was the first time. I love my sticker books. Oh my gosh, Happy Planner. They just get cuter and cuter all the time. All the time. I'm not so much down with the uh, the whole Stargazer Wonderlust kind of stuff. I'm like, eh, no thank you. But the florals, like the botanical book and everything, beautiful, beautiful. Okay. I swear, guys, normally I don't have this problem. So I'm going to bring in this. This is really cute little very thin washi tape, which is perfect for the smaller planners. It even This even works really well on my A5. It just does. And then I'm going to line my lines with that. Oh, my chihuahua's falling asleep. He's starting to snore. I have a chihuahua with sleep apnea, sleep apnea because of their little small nasal canals as they get older. And when he snores, it is loud, very loud. You know he is in the room Walla makes his presence known. It's 
something else I also need. I have a regular little box cutter, and I'm wondering if that would work as an exacto knife. Because that's something I, I keep forgetting to try and pick up somewhere. And I see people using them. I'm like, oh, I need one of those. Because they get such nice cuts. It's not so noticeable on these smaller uh, washi tape uh, rolls, but it is very noticeable on the big ones if you don't get a, a straight cut. So I'm like, hmm. I'll catch one on sale one day. I have to budget, budget, budget these days, guys. I mean, we're seriously budgeting to till hopefully my disability will come through soon and if you guys um are new and you haven't viewed me before i have i worked up until last year i used to work in a hospital um and i just i have some really pretty serious uh, painful conditions and so i had to stop working november of last year and my husband still has his job, but he also has some health problems that have really um, financially taken a toll on us, just like mine have. And so with the loss of an income plus tons of medical bills coming in, we've been having a very difficult time, like a lot of people in America today, just paying, you know, normal bills and having gas money to go places on, in your car when you need to and all of that has become a struggle so i applied for my disability back in may and i also got in touch with uh my senator's office state senator because since disability is on a federal level you have to get in touch with the your federal representatives um and they I let them know, you know, all the stuff that's going on, you know, gave them details and they have been just wonderful about helping me try to get my disability. I mean, they have called the office, their disability office, like I think three times to get them on the ball to expedite it. And they are, I have two doctor's appointments this month um, that specifically related to the disability some have some of their doctors examine me to see what's going on exactly oh i'm sorry i knocked you and hopefully you know that goes well and from there they'll be able to speed it up once i get that started it won't of course it won't be as much as i was making per month um but we, my husband had borrowed against his 401k and paid off, we paid off some things, his car and things like that to cut down on our monthly bills. And when I get my disability to go through, I'll get back pay for that. And I plan on using it to pay off uh, the rest of our medical bills and then to pay off my car. So that monthly bill is no longer it. And so at, with those two things gone, um, we should be fine we should be fine so it's just a matter of being patient and budgeting seriously until then but god is good and god does supply and he will supply everything i'm not stressed about it at all my husband gets a little bit stressed because you know now he's 100 percent responsible for the you know our bills i'm like but i said not really because god is our provider he's the one's 100 percent responsible and he has said he would provide all our needs and pretty sure he's going to do what he said because he always has i've seen tough times before and god has always 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 brought brought us through so you know you got seasons seasons of abundance and then seasons of not so much abundance I'm really just going to pretty one this up a little bit. See, I tried to get that one straight. Not straight. I have an inner ear imbalance. We'll tell you some of my little stories. So, <laughs> so sometimes that thing acts up. And if, if anybody else has one, you know what I'm talking about. 
you just get really super duper dizzy and uh all kinds of funny stuff happens to you <laughs> it's like woo. okay let's see let's see tuesdays i have some volunteer work i do so i really don't have a lot going on but this week i'm trying to think is it this week See, this week ends in the 12th. Yeah, this week. So Monday I have a doctor's appointment. And then on Wednesday I have a doctor's appointment. So I have to put those down. Uh, they don't have any of the colors I want. I'm trying to actually just use this sticker book. I've never done that before, just used one. But this thing is primarily washi tape. And so, I don't see a whole lot of to-do stickers in there. At least not in the color I'm needing. Hmm. Well, let's try this. I like the little purple to go, that goes with black, so let's see if this will work. This is going to be funny because it's going to be me trying to get it straight. Super, 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 super fun. See, it just... I don't think my nails help me in these situations, but that's not a casualty of war I'm, I'm willing to give up. <laughs> So, I'm going to put to-do with my appointments up here. And, uh, da, 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 da. go back to that flowery page. So, I'm going to put this here for the day of my volunteer work because I enjoyed that so much it's not really work I go in and I sit down and, and just you know counsel some people so it's not really work it's a labor of love because I can't as long as I work I, I that's I was trying to do that two days a week just four hours a day just hanging out there and helping out where I could and could not even do that I ended up having to cut it down to one day and I stay usually you know a half day even there like two hours or so I just I wear out so quickly it's so frustrating you've got things that you want to do things that you know that just it's just frustrating it's, it's frustrating when your body decides hey we don't want to do anything now we're, we're kind of done and there's still lots of things that you want to do Okay, I think I found what I want. The plan for this day will be that first doctor's appointment. The doctor's appointment that I have on Monday of next week is um, for the, the Social Security Department, Disability Department set up for me. And then the one I have on Wednesday is just with my regular doctor just for my yearly checkup my you know the woman thing the woman's checkup got that going on and I want a little even though it's not Halloween week I still want a little bit of Halloween going on so we'll put Mr. Mr. Bat right here and do you guys put out Halloween decorations I pretty much decorate for everything. I just, some people are like, no, I don't want to do Halloween. I'm like, I love the kids. I love seeing the kids in their, you know, little costumes and everything. It just makes me so happy. But I know that's not everybody's thing. Okay. 
so Monday, I think it's the 14th. So let me go back look 12th. So this will be the 13th, 14th, 15th, 16th, 17th, 18th, and 19th. Okay, so 14 doctor's appointments, and that is in Portland. I hate going to Portland. Okay, and then Wednesday, my appointment with my doctor. And then Tuesday, volunteer work. Okay. Hold on. I'm going to have to break down and use another sticker book. I'm going to have to. You can't help yourself. I'm find the one I want. Oh, come on. I had it last night. See if this has what I can use. <laughs> Try to find my botanicals book because it's just got beautiful flowers in it that's really super cute for um fall what I need right now what I'm looking for is a couple of little flowers just to tip some things I don't want big ones oh that's pretty I like that that would actually work nicely but I'm not sure where I should put it Ooh. I don't think I have anything else going on. Oh, maybe I can just put it underneath my doctor's appointment here. This is so pretty. Look at there. It's got the purples in it. That ties that in together nicely. And then since Friday will be shopping day, I can stick this one on there to buy. See it right up against my washi tape. And it's still crooked. I told you guys. <laughs> Just drives me nuts. Does anybody else drive yourself nuts? Because I totally drive myself nuts. <laughs> this one here says, May your coffee be strong and your Monday be short. <laughs> That's pretty cute, actually. I kind of like it. kind of like it a lot. Oh, let's see if I got anything in this one. This is my favorite, favorite Happy Planner sticker book. It's simply lovely. I actually have another one that I just bought because I've used so much of this one. And I just, I just love it. I just love it so much. And this will actually go in very, 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 very well with this theme. If I can find what I want. Does anybody else completely destroy your sticker books? I do. But it's out of love. It's because I love them. I just love them so much. Some of these are just too big for these smaller ones. I love these bows with the pink. Look at that. It's just I'm telling you, this is just the prettiest sticker book I think they've ever done. It's just so, so cute. To find the perfect one. I love the way this one incorporates the pinks and the blues and the blue. They just complement each other so nicely. So nicely. Okay, let's do a couple of little 
Hmm. Hmm. I don't think I have any errands that day, but I'm going to put this here because I'm pretty sure I can find some errands to do. That one there. Ooh, little ants. We are still inundated with ants and insects. It's crazy. This year has just been, I mean, spiders. Oh my gosh, guys, the spiders I have found in my house. You know, I'm not scared of spiders, but when they're as big as the palm of your hand, that gets a little unnerving. And these bad boys have been huge. Do one more. Oh, let's incorporate this with this. This would be really, really, really cute. Um, ma, 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 ma. Don't have anything under Thursday, so we will stick that right there. And I'm going to pull this up. I probably will not be able to get it back down, but it's just annoying me because it's so crooked. Yeah, that's probably done for. Uh, I just want one more thingy. One more that might work. And then we'll call this. Okay, I'm going to do this. Well, no, I've already got it today there. That would be silly. Aren't you guys glad I'm so together and so decisive? Let's see. I would honestly like just a little flower. Just a little flower that would match. And that's where my botanical book would come in handy. If I had, you know, myself together, that is. You guys would be shocked if I was to ever just pan around and, you know, take the camera and just let you look at my little room. You'd, you'd be fearful for me, I'm afraid. I found it. Yay. Everybody cheer. Woo. Say good job, Melissa. Oh, I'm going to use this one because I think these are gorgeous. I almost, I have three, I think it's, no, four happy, um, excuse me, Carpe Diem personal size planners that have never been opened. They have the inserts and everything in them. Uh, I purchased them back uh, the, earlier in spring when they were having their huge clearance sale. Altogether, I think I ended up getting um, six small ones and six of the large ones and a couple of them I gifted. But I almost put one of those out because it's blue and it's got... Um, black lace roses on the front I almost opened it up and used it but because it still has its you know brand new inserts and the inserts are gorgeous they have roses and everything with along with that color but I mean really 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 pretty see how this one has the see if you can see it has the flowers in the background there I think that's just gorgeous oh I have an older dog who's hacking over there. Okay, that basically does what I wanted to do. So there it is. That is my little teeny tiny planner. Oopsies. Layout for the week of the 13th. I hope you guys like this because I don't normally do this. 
I usually just plan stuff out and say, look what I did, you know, <laughs> instead of actually having the pressure of doing it right beside you guys. But anyway, there is my plan with me. Thank you so much for tuning in. See you next time. Same place, same station. Don't forget to subscribe. Like, please like me. And then hit that notification bell because I really do post very, 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 very frequently. You can go back and look at all my other videos and see that. So we always try to have fun. And love you guys. Have a blessed day. I love you. Jesus loves you. And we're, we're awesome. We're awesome. All right, guys. Bye-bye.